Hello everybody, this is Jeff at eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a look at the GoPower 2000 watt 100 amp industrial pure sine wave inverter and inverter charger. Now this is a 3-in-1 system that will combine pure sine wave inverter, a converter charger, and an automatic transfer switch. This combined system will help save space and means you only have to install one component. It will include everything I got laid out here on the table. It includes this IC series inverter charger. It includes the fixed mount remote right over here. Comes with a 50 foot long remote cable. Has a battery temperature sensor with a 25 foot long cable. Two DC terminal covers, red and black, two ring lugs, hardware to install those parts, and it even comes with nice user's manual for the remote and even for the inverter charger. Now this 2000 watt inverter will change your battery's DC output into AC power and sends it to the RV's electrical system. The pure sine wave technology will replicate your household AC power, allowing you to run devices safely. This converter charger will change the AC shore power to DC power to quickly charge your batteries, provides continuous power to your DC breaker panel to run 12 volt loads, and it offers multi-stage charging which helps extend your battery life. The transfer switch in it will automatically change from inverter to shore power when you hook up at the campground. Now the included fixed mount remote right here. This will let you monitor and control the inverter charger from inside your RV. The 25 foot long cable here with the battery temperature sensor that it comes with. This one end right here will mount onto your battery. The other end plugs into the inverter charger. And the temperature data will help adjust your voltage to maintain proper charging. Now it does have multiple connection points that will let you secure cables and external devices to the inver inverter. Now three of the sides, you can see this side, uh, this one does. This side does, right over here, and over here this side does. Three of the sides have exhaust air vents if you notice, and on two of the sides right here they have built-in handles that make it easy to maneuver this. <clears throat> now one side, right over here, let me spin it around here. If you notice on the bottom there's the two buttons here. This one side has two AC input circuit breakers, and then right here it has an AC access cover. <clears throat> the other side, right over here. This will have, let me step to the front here, it'll have the AC input and output terminals. Has the DC input terminals right here. Right over here it has the remote port that you plug your remote into. Down here it has the battery sensor port. Right up here is an on and off switch. And then over here they have some LED indicators which will show the inverter status and fault conditions. Now they do offer a fuse block installation kit that we do sell separately on our website that will let you safely connect the inverter charger to your RV battery. Application again, this is for 12 volt battery systems. Now the inverter rated power, the running rated power output is 2000 watts. The starting or surge power output is 4000 watts. The dimensions on this, the inverter itself, let me zoom in again so we can get you some dimensions. The Inverter itself lengthwise is going to be measured from here to where these posts stick out. So if we put a tape measure on that, it's going to get you right at about 15 inches long. The width on it, I am going to measure the very bottom because you'll notice it has these mounting tabs that extend out on the bottom. So if I put a ruler on that, from one mounting tab to the other is going to be right at 12 and a half inches wide. And then the overall height of this is going to be right at 8 inches tall. Now the remote, I'm going to measure the remote for you. The size on this remote right here is going to be the front of it. I'm going to first give you the front dimensions. It's going to be right at 5 and 7 eighths inches wide by 3 and 7 eighths inches tall. The rear, the cutout dimensions, which are in the back here, it is going to be about four and three quarter inches wide, two and three quarter inches tall, and the depth of it, including that port that sticks out, is going to be right about one and a quarter inches deep. 
Now the total weight on this whole unit is about 40 pounds. But that should do it for the review on this GoPower 2000 watt 100 amp industrial pure sine wave inverter and inverter charger.